Hey guys, it's Shane from Jack's Journeys. I'm back today at Dreamworld Theme Park in the Gold Coast. Now this is just going to be a really quick video to give you some quick updates of some more changes and construction updates that are happening here at Dreamworld. Anyway, let's go now and check it all out. So why don't you come along with me and join the journey. All right, so we just made it inside the park, and the first thing we've noticed is they've now finally got the words Dreamworld back on the globe. Now, I did provide an update of this on our Instagram, but here it is on video. And it looks like they're also redoing all the decking there in front of the globe too, which is going to look amazing. So just looking around the other side now and to the front of the globe, they've done a lot more work since our last visit. In fact, look at the buildings. Uh, the finishings are looking amazing. The queue line here is looking absolutely fantastic, especially with the landscaping at the front. And that really reminds me of something almost like a, a Disney style of queuing area. So again, looking absolutely amazing. And the chair swing itself, uh, Dream of Fire, is just looking beautiful. And obviously, they've still got a lot more work to do, but they have now started doing uh, testing on that. And uh, they're going to do a lot more work on putting the water fountains in and a few other finishing touches to the surrounding buildings and landscaping. And once again, it is really good to see testing happening now. The dream will fly. So hopefully, hopefully we'll see this open by the end of November, if not sooner. Fingers crossed. All right, well, it's really awesome to see so much more progress on the Dream Will Fly and the new sign on the globe as well at the front. Anyway, let's go check out the roller coaster construction at the Wiggles Big Red Boat Roller Coaster. And I'm not sure why, but uh, the, uh, the Bilby here is missing from the uh, squirting characters here, where they squirt you as you walk through to Kenny and Belinda's Dreamland. And down here outside Belinda's uh, treehouse, they've uh, finally finished the pathway. So last time we were here, uh, they had all the construction fencing up, but now it all blends through and looks beautiful. And also the Bananas and Pajamas Fun Maze, they've now put up some umbrellas for shade, which is really good. It was definitely needed in this area. All right, let's take a quick look at the Wiggles Big Red Boat Ride Roller Coaster construction. So they've also got some new signage up on the fencing outside the Wiggles Big Red Boat Roller Coaster construction and a QR code too that you can scan for more info about the ride. Well, I've got to tell you, they've done a significant amount of work since our last visit here on the Big Red Boat roller coaster ride. This is absolutely moving ahead very fast. So again, we'll keep you updated with regular construction updates. So as you can see, lots of progress is happening here. We'll keep you updated on more construction progress of the big red boat roller coaster in the future. And just over at Tiger Island, uh, I guess the scorpion must have just been here as part of that uh, like the animal hunt for Halloween, because this is now back to the Cub Kindy and no more scorpion in there at all. All right, so we're gonna have a look at the demolition now of the ABC Kids World. So obviously that was the old pathway that went down. Now we turn right here and let's take a look. I'll tell you what, they've actually done quite a lot of demolition through here. The 
so that's actually the uh, Billabong restaurant. So pretty much all that Wiggles area is now gone. That was essentially through here. So that's all now gone. Lots have definitely been demolished. Now on our last visit, essentially they just started the demolition in the ABC Kids World, but uh, they're really moving on with that now. And uh, most of it's actually uh, demolished now already, but we're just gonna walk around the other side and try and get a better view, see what the other side looks like. So this is Billabong restaurant. Looking through here, this is where the Wiggles house was, or I guess the big red car ride building. So that's completely demolished now, as we just saw from the other angle through there. So that's uh, an area they've concentrated on through there. That's where the big mountain is gonna go for Jungle Rush. It's gonna be a massive uh, mountain there, essentially. It's gonna be around about the height of the claw, just to give you perspective of how big that will be. This is probably a little bit of a better perspective. Billabong restaurant, uh, you've got the, there was a teacup ride just here. And that's where the big red car ride building and retail shops were. So that's all demolished in that area right now. Anyway, we'll go around the other side and see what else we can have a look at. By the way, guys, I just want to wish Dan Tessman a very happy birthday for Monday, the 6th of November. I hope you have an awesome birthday, Dan from Shane at Jag's Journeys. All right, so we just have that final look, looking through the old ABC Kids World from the angle near the motor coaster, and we'll check out the rest of the demolition through there. Well, from this angle, a lot more has changed. All the buildings that we featured last time that were starting to get demolished, they're now completely gone. There's a little bit of rubble left over. And yeah, obviously this site now is getting pretty clear. So once they get rid of the rest of the rides and structures, it'll start being transformed into Rivertown. Hey guys, just a reminder that uh, while they're building Rivertown and doing the construction there at the old ABC at Kids World area, uh, the Dreamworld Express train will, when it departs uh, Central Station here, and um, heads down the park and stops at the first stop which is the corroboree stop once it's uh, unloaded the passengers and reloaded it then actually reverses back up the track as it's doing right now back up through here into central station so again this will be like this for about 12 months whilst they're doing the uh, construction of rivertown and then obviously the train track will be reinstated and the Dreamworld Express will be back around the park once again. Hey guys, that's going to do it for my look today here at Dreamworld Theme Park in the Gold Coast. Uh, just a quick video today to give you some construction updates of the progress that's happening around the park with all the different projects that they've got going on. And as usual, Jags Journeys will continue to give you updates as the weeks and months go ahead as well. And we're really excited to keep track of the construction in Rivertown. That's going to be really exciting. Anyway guys, if you do like this kind of content, make sure you subscribe for more. Please give the video a like, lets me know that you care. Also, don't forget to check us out on our social media platforms. We're on TikTok, Instagram, Threads, and Facebook as well. Anyway guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next journey.